Hello, gentlemen. Patrick Ryan here, founder of Wingman for You. We help men confidently approach women in order so they can find the woman of their dreams. Now, gentlemen, this video is about teenage sex. It's about our young people and how they're struggling right now with relationships, with social stigmas, with social anxiety. And a lot of this may have been passed down because of the pandemic. Now guys, according to the Center for Disease Control, which studies and surveys teenagers in high school all across the country, as of 2019, 38% of those teenagers were having sexual intercourse. As of 2021, just two years later, that number was down to 30%. And in fact, back in 1990, that number was well above 50%. So they're wondering whether it is all the great education that is surrounded and talked about with regards to sexual relations at young, uh, young ages. Of course, the scaredness of, or I guess I should say the reluctance to try sex because of either sexually transmitted diseases or of course, young pregnancies. So guys, some of the things that came out of this report written by Jocelyn Gecker, and it was actually just published yesterday in the Washington Post, specifically has these young people saying, when they came out of the pandemic, they really awkward in social situations. They didn't know how to express themselves verbally. They can do it on a text message, they can do it on social media, but to stand in front of somebody and express themselves verbally was a huge and continues to be a huge struggle amongst our young people. Now, gentlemen, I don't know what we can do specifically for young people other than help build their confidence, help teach them how to communicate, help them be less anxious and nervous around partners or potential partners and talk a little bit more openly about, well, not just sex, but about your emotions and about their feelings. One of the things that came out of the survey is that they have a really challenged time expressing their emotions and their feelings to other students or classmates, or let's just call them colleagues, other people that are young, and they don't really understand what is the struggle. So guys, this can be a big struggle for young people. I'm here to help young people. Quite frankly, I understand that they may not have a lot of income to spend on some great social programs that I've got. However, if you're a young person and you're struggling, I'll love to talk to you and help you out. And I'll do this pro bono because I know that when I was young, I struggled too. Appreciate you tuning in today. Subscribe to my channel for some great video content that may help you be less anxious in social situations. And I'll see you in the next video.